This is the Africa you dream of. This is the Africa I dream of. We went to school together. We both went to the same school. Yeah. Shut up, there's a giraffe? It's such a unique opportunity to take a journey like this with one of my best friends and share in his experience of going home. I'm happy to come back, but at the same time, I'm a stranger here. Are we okay here? Hey! Are we going up there? Yeah, we're going up. Christy, Christy. Okay, welcome, welcome, welcome. So none of this looks familiar? The people don't look the same, the place doesn't look the same, nothing here. That's your food, that's what you're gonna eat. I'm not eating the chicken anymore. You're gonna eat it. Look. No! <laughs> you drink this? Yeah. He's swimming in the river. You swim and bathe and drink this water. That's the way they don't think about it. When my mom was sick, I got to spend time with her this disease that has been killing a lot of people in Africa. People like are the most vulnerable. What happened to her parents? Her parents died with HIV. Both of them had it? Yeah. In the United States, it's okay to say you're HIV positive. You're still gonna have your friends around. But here, it's not. They would shun her. They shun my mother. I just feel really, like, sheltered. We don't have to worry about clean water or disease or anything and I've taken it all for granted. We go through hardship and then the harder the day, the better the celebration will be.